special greetings to you. Happy New Year. My name is Mioni Daniel Zoga. I want to wish you a very prosperous year ahead. You know, in a season like this, at a time like this, so much is always on our mind. People write New Year resolutions. People tend to seek out new avenues to make their life better. People tend to write out new do's and don'ts. People try to figure out, okay, where did I fail last year? What are the things I didn't do right? And what are the things I need to do? Some other people tend to be negatively affected by the happenings of the past year. I want to let you know that you need to be optimistic and positive about every new year and every day that God allows come your way. You know, life is a gift. And the Bible says, God is faithful not to tempt us beyond what we can handle. Meaning, at every day of our life, no matter the challenges we face, there is something, there is an ability He has put in us to pull through that challenge or to come out of it victorious. You are a success and you have all it takes to be successful. Don't be depressed for the things you didn't do right. Don't be downcasted for the results you could not make up. Don't be discouraged. Don't lose your focus. Don't lose your cool. Don't panic. God is still involved and in your life as far as you still have trust in Him. In a time like this, the wrong thing to do is to look back and get depressed. If you must look back at the challenges that you've been through, make sure it is in the positive light, where you look at it and draw strength to move ahead, rather than allowing them depress you or keep you down or keep you in a state where you can no more move. The fact that things didn't go right does not mean it will always not go right. Sometimes it is just that you did not act right to get that positive result required. Stay focused, stay bold, stay brave. For the Bible says, as a man thinketh in his heart, so is he. Don't think you are a failure because that's where the game lies. The devil fights your mind. Life is a battle of the mind. The mind is what limits us, and the mind is what sets us ahead. In this new year, I would like you to be positive. I would like you to speak positive things to yourself. Tell yourself, I can make it. I can pull through this. See this challenge, I will get through in a grand style. Tell yourself, I will surpass my expectation. Tell yourself, I will hit these goals. Don't get discouraged. Don't get discouraged at all. Don't be afraid. God has something special for you in this new year. So much around, fears all over, but you are more than a conqueror. That's what the scripture says. That's what the one who has the manual over your life has programmed for you. That's part of what he has put inside of you. You cannot be stopped by anyone but you. And that's the battle of the mind. If there is any battle you will fight this year, if there is any victory you need to win, is to fight and conquer the battle of the mind. Don't limit yourself by your thoughts. Don't limit yourself by the happenstance around you, the things that happen each day around you. Never allow them to limit your thoughts. Stay focused. If you try and fail, try again. Just know that you haven't discovered the right technique or you didn't take the right step you need to take and figure out another way out. There is always a way out. Don't give up. This year can be the best year of your life. You can recover all you think you've lost in the past year, if only you win the battle of the mind. Thank you. Happy New Year.
wish you lots of success expect to see you back on this channel thank you do enjoy your year happy new year